so today's patrol is going to be the Sandy Grapeseed Harmony area. So we're going to be doing uh, up towards Seaview. We're not going to go into the 2000s, but we're going to stay in the three. Excuse me. We're going to stay in the 3000s north of Route 13. Uh, so we're going to stay in that stuff. We're going to be doing a little bit of Harmony area. So just the four. Looks like 410 through 4. 425 roughly that kind of little area down there so we're doing harmony grand uh grand sonora desert and then also here in sandy shores we'll be doing this kind of little area um unless obviously that might change in the future but we're going to be doing that for right I'm now sorry. jesus christ people will just decide to punch me um so we're going to be doing that let me fix my player we're going to be doing that Basically, what you're saying is stay on the sand no, cause no, cause we're not going out to we're not going all no. We're not doing all the sand. We're just doing some of the sand. Hey, oh, actually, we are doing all the sand. According to the map, we're doing the sand part, and a little bit of the green part to the south. We're doing the sandy bit. Um, obviously, I want you guys to stay spread out. Um, we do have dispatch, so make sure you guys are using dispatch correctly. Um. If you need an, uh, another unit, make sure you call it. Um, if you need a supervisor, make sure you call me. If you're not sure of something, it's all right if you call me. It's fine. You don't have to, you know, think that you don't have to. Uh, if you ever do, just call me. Um, other than that, uh, I think I'm all good with everything else. Obviously, I'm going to be in a Dodge Charger. We got a bike and a Vic. Um, so, Aaron, stay safe on the bike. Um, and all that kind of stuff. I'll do the best I can with one hand. Yeah, so other than that, that's about it. Uh, just make sure you guys are all in CAD. Make sure you guys fill up your guys' gas tanks. Uh, make sure you guys have your weapons and stuff like that. And make sure your lights work. And yeah, that's about it. Uh, you guys are all good to go tonight and stuff. Okay. Before you guys go tonight, please remember postal codes. That is all. Uh, yes, postal codes are on. Uh, in the escape menu and they are also in the CAD. You can use the postal code map in the CAD to look at them. I updated the CAD. And give me and give me the postal code because I would not know where you at. Are you just uh, dispatch not in game? Yeah, he's I just am, dispatch. I'm dispatch. I'm dispatch for that. Okay, so we're gonna... Tell you, my will say I'm dispatching every night. So we're gonna mark ourselves that. Um, so we're gonna be... Yet. In a Dodge Charger, we're gonna be the supervisor today. We're gonna to have I'm one sheriff to in a Vic, and then we're also going 45. to have a highway and a bike because uh, we're area. gonna be testing out that as a possible subdivision. So we're gonna show you today and doing some testing out for that. Um, hopefully, we'll get some more people on. I know we're gonna have, I think, two. Uh, I'm not sure how many super we actually have. Right now, it's just AI. The Civs haven't got on yet, but we're gonna be doing this for now. We're gonna fill up our tank with gas and then head out. I don't know what that unit's doing. I don't know if he's just glitched out. Yeah, he's just glitched out. Fill on gas. So obviously this is going to be another one of those kind of like combined episodes of two different patrols. Okay. One tank of one dispatch. One tank of one. Uh, show me 10-8, active supervisor, and the San Shores Armory area. 10-4, show you 10-4 to 1, 10-8, uh, as active supervisor at 2-36, have a great, a great safe patrol. Thank you. So. We're going to be patrolling, I think I'm going to go more out towards Route 68 and do that kind of area, or Joshua Road. So we're going to head out there, see if we can get some action out there. In this to all units, AOP is now in Sandy Shores, Grape Seed, and Harmony. I repeat again, Sandy Shores, Grape Seed, and Harmony have a safe patrol, all units tonight. Oh, oops, we should probably buckle up. 
So we're gonna head out here, I think. We're gonna get over to Route 68 and do a maybe we'll do a speed trip over there and just see what kind of activity we got over there. like Eli was trying to join. Get some bicyclists. Around. So I think we're gonna head down into Harmony. 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 Uh, and at getting into a nice little nook and cranny somewhere. I haven't really been down here in a little bit, so I got, I'm gonna have to look for nice spots. Those bushes might be a nice cover. Actually, yeah, we're gonna park up over here. We're gonna do, get our radar on. We're gonna set it to 50. opposite for that and yeah we're gonna look for people going on a little bit faster than that one tango one dispatch tango one show me signal 11 route 68 grand Sonora desert uh by postal 4024 so i show you uh signal 11 postal 24 Okay, so uh, we'll uh, see if we get anybody uh, speeding or even defective vehicles. Okay, that guy was going 65. We're gonna try and catch up to him. Okay. One second, I'll walk. Tango one. Uh, show me attempt to catch up to a black vehicle uh, weaving in and out of traffic. Uh, negative, I might get him on a stop. Uh, we're going to be right now on Route 68. He's weaving in and out of traffic going about 60, 70 miles per hour. Yeah, 10 4, I got a vehicle stop. Near his postal. Uh, hold one moment. We're gonna get this guy off to the side here. Let's take that. Let's try that again. One single one. We're actually going to be in the 1080 at this time. We're out 68, heading westbound traffic, Grand Sonora Desert. If I can get 1032s. So, this vehicle is actually going to be taken off from us. 10 4. Um, Marble 45, Tango 57, respond. Tango 57, respond. Uh, be aware, Route 68, Grand Sonora Desert, still heading westbound. The uh, unit tried to roadblock, failed, and subjects are going to still be continuing. Speed's about at 60 miles per hour, getting up to 70 now. Still weaving in and out of traffic at this time. About to be passing dollar pills. Can I get a pit timer started, please? Yeah, vehicle almost just lost control while passing a vehicle. We're going to be continuing Route 68 westbound uh, through Harmony at this time, past Joshua. Now going to be heading towards the military base at this time. Be advised, pit time is uh, ETA 5 minutes. Yeah, 10 4. Subject was 10 50 with a tractor over on Route 68. Still continuing.
I'm like fiercely concentrating on getting. Okay, you just head on with another vehicle. Subject's now trying to push my vehicle. 10 4, subject's trying to push you. Yeah, 10 4. Yeah, subject's taking off around Sheriff. Uh, he's gonna be continuing back eastbound now at this time. If we can get medical rolled over on Route 68 uh, by the T junction, the Y junction kind of thing, for a possible injury. injury. We can get county on that. Uh, vehicle's now heading Route 68 southeast. Take a one bit by you are to bit. You are good to bit. 10 4. I'm going to be waiting until we get into somewhere a little bit more straight. Okay. At this time, weather conditions clear, pedestrian count low, vehicle traffic medium. Just another 10 50. 10 50. Okay, vehicle's going to be continuing at this time. Weather still clear, vehicle count low, pedestrian count minimal. I'm going to be attempting to pit once he passes the next vehicle. Take a few seconds, that was really good. Pit zip. Go Tango zero one. Pit performed. Successful. Boxing vehicle in at this time. Show me your hands! Pit for some boxing vehicle. Yeah, it's subject at gunpoint. Tango 57, Tango 01. Tango 01, go ahead. 1020. Uh, we're gonna be Route 68 at this time. Tango postal code. Uh, nearest postal code is going to be 20, uh, excuse me, 4023. Uh, subject in custody. Uh, okay, shots fired by AI. Uh, just to confirm, 4023, correct? Yeah. I'm I'm dealing with AI that's gone kind of crazy. Unit, just revive and uh, get your vehicle off the road. Yeah. Uh, one second, one dispatch. Be aware, subject in custody at this time. Going to be getting. Uh, a county transport well, for I'm this lady. Two four. Okay, ma'am. At this time, I'm going to be searching. You have anything? You have a poke stick at me or anything like that? Okay, you're all clear. Let's uh, do a breathalyzer test on you, actually, because I'm kind of curious if you've been uh, drinking at all. Take a one. Uh, it says one hundred should be missing. Uh, yes, ten four. Ten four. Sitting on your signal 100 has been lifted. Wow, you're all clear, man. It's still in effect. Okay, but you are going to be taken down to jail at this time for fleeing from officers. So, you know, you shouldn't have done that. Yeah, you've injured several people and you've hurt officers and stuff like that. So you are going to be going down to jail. So at this time, you do have the right to remain silent. Anything you do say may be going to court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford one, one will be appointed to you by the court. Do you understand these rights that I've read you? Okay, awesome, because the uh, transport's on their way. Okay, I'm going to search this car really quickly, uh, Jeffrey, and then if you want to call a tow on it. Yes. Oh, you decide to show up finally. Yeah, okay, vehicle's clear. Hey, hey, it is kind of hard to drive with one hand. That is true, but where were you? Jesus. I, I kind of started going the wrong way, too. Ah. GPS does not work. On Bravo 45 to dispatch. Bravo 45. Requesting a um, tow truck and our current 1020. Hey ma'am, come back here. Tier 4 Bravo This officer's gonna take you down to the uh, jail for marks. me. Bravo 45. Uh, 10 9, please. Bravo 45. 
one bro, 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 bro. Uh, be advised, AI, five mics out, DB. Okay, we can get Connie, uh, tow over here. One thing I want to dispatch, uh, be aware. Prisoner has been transported by county over to Brooklyn Penitentiary. 10 4. Is this the tow truck? Showing all units 10 8 except, uh, unit transport. I think it is, but I don't know what he is doing. Uh, Aaron, you might want to move back. Uh, uh, come back. Uh, who is the transporting unit? Uh, counting. 10 4. Showing Bravo 45, uh, transport. Okay, I don't know. You might just want to do it again. Did you say? Uh, you might just want to try towing it again. Okay, I don't, I don't, just, yeah. Yeah, uh, I'd say just give up on yeah. it. Yeah. It tried. It failed. Well, it's tried twice in the AI, it's not doing it, but you know. Do a bench, just saw him run a red light. Uh, if I get a 1032 at this time, it's gonna be a two door uh, banshee, uh, unknown occupied. Sir, can you step back in your vehicle for me? I got my time to at this time. Can I'm you step back? To some money. Well, sir, I need you to step back in your vehicle for me. I can take that. Ten four. You can take Alrighty, piggy. I want to take a one dispatch. Uh, so vehicle description is going to be a black two-door Banshee, occupied times one, uh, legal red underglow, possible legal window tint, um, uh, occupied with a white male wearing a hat and a gray shirt. Also marked down a legal horn. New postal. Uh, postal is going to be 1055 at the uh, Point County Savings Bank in Toledo Bay. That music is trash. Hey, unit. So, I'm stopping him because back there at the intersection, back that way, I was pulling over somebody else, and then he came flying through at a red light. Uh, actually passed traffic, drifted into this parking lot, and so yeah, that's where we are now. But uh, he's probably going to get possible warnings or tickets for illegal underglow, window tent which will have to attack, and the uh, legal horns. Okay. Hey sir, can you roll down your window for me? Show me can you uh, roll down your window for me? Okay, can you stop, stop with the horn? Uh, uh, that's my music. That's your music. Okay, I need you to turn off your music then. Uh, One thousand five. All right. Uh, All right. What uh, you want? Okay. Do you know why I'm stopping you today? Hell no, I don't. Okay. Well, back there at that intersection over there, I saw you illegally pass a vehicle on a double yellow, and then also you drifted into this parking lot, and then you went through that intersection with a red. It was a red. Zedan. 
So I'm gonna need your driver's license, proof of insurance. Sorry, what was that? My uh, ears were glitching up. Your ears were glitching out there? So I said I'm pulling you over today because you crossed a devil yellow over uh, back at that intersection to pass a vehicle and then went through a red light and then you drifted into this parking lot here. So I need your driver's license, proof of insurance. I got a very good reason for that. Give me just a second for my life. Okay, well, we'll, we'll see your good reason here in a moment. So, let's see. I got these mismatched. There you do. Okay, sir. Uh, I will be right back with you. Or actually, here, let's, let's hear your reasoning for doing that. Got some very important good. I got a lot of stuff to do here. What kind of stuff do you have to do? That's none of your concern. Okay. Well, I'll be right back with you, sir, okay? And don't play any music while I'm sitting here. Can I put my money in the bank? No, you can stay in your vehicle and you can do that after. Thank you. One tango, hey, one. Sir, but... Two, one tango. 57. Do you want to run that? Or Little piggy with the messed up hand. Give me that plate. Say again. That little piggy. Uh, do you want to read off that plate for me? Airfirm, it is Golf Romeo India November Golf Oscar Piggy. Temporal, thank you. Tango on one. Tango on, go ahead. Be advised that plate doesn't come back. Yeah, time for it, be aware. Uh, Hello, uh, do you understand this English? Is, uh, yeah, not a member. Sif. Ten four. Uh... Okay, sir. So, really quickly, I'm gonna check your window tint right here, okay? Because your window tint's quite dark, so I'm just gonna put this little reader on it, okay? Um. And then uh, we'll see what uh, after that, okay? So let me well, just do this really quick. You see, my window's not up. Well, s sir, I'm, I'm asking you to put your window up just a little bit so I can put my reader on it. You want me to put my window up? All right, I got it open. Okay, sir. Um, and what's up with your underglow? Tired me, I can't hear you. My window. Oh, sir, you're, I can see your face. Bailey, Bailey, what? what? I, I can see your face. I only asked you to put your window up slightly. <laughs> well, I put them up all the way. Y'all want me to roll them back down? Yes, I want you to roll them back down. Oh, okay. Okay, so. What's up with your uh, underglow? What underglow? What are you talking about? Okay, sir, I can see your red underglow right now. And I bet that other officer can as well. I have underglow? Uh, oh, yeah. heck. The person I bought this car from like 20 minutes ago, we must have put it on there. Okay, well, that is illegal considering it is the color red and you were driving on public streets with it. Okay. So, I'll be right back with you, okay? I'm just going to talk to my other officer, and then we'll get this all finished up, and, uh, do that. I'm going to come over come here. Back over by your, yeah, yeah, I'm going to come back over So I think I'm gonna write him a warning. Uh, actually, I'm probably gonna write him a few tickets, honestly. Probably one for the reckless driving. Uh, 
uh, which will include the drifting, running the red light, and stuff like that. So one reckless driving ticket, a warning on the underglow, and then also another ticket on the uh, tint. April. Okay. Okay, so I need to turn off that music for me. What? Is that World War Two? Okay, sir. So, at this time, I am going to need you to sign in the bottom of these two tickets. Um, one is going to be for your reckless driving, which is going to include the drifting, running the red light, and crossing the double yellow. The other one's going to be including your window tint. So if you need to sign at the bottom there, it's not a mission of guilt, but it's just saying that you'll uh, get them taken care of, okay, in some way, either that being you know, taking them to court or whatever. Um, and then here's also a written warning for you. Uh, that's going to be for the underglow. I'm just going to write you a warning on that one, uh, considering you did say you just bought the car. So you're going to either want to get that removed or color changed, okay? And don't use it on public roads. So you need to get that turned off. So... Just, uh... There you go. That one's for you back there. Here, let me... Get it that way. Okay, so just make sure you turn it off. I don't, uh, you're not allowed to leave here until that underglow is turned off. Obviously, you can go on the bank and stuff like that, but you cannot move this vehicle until the underglow is turned off and you, uh... Show me, um... Get that off and then you can leave. watch out, I'm going to the bank. Sorry, what was that? Little bit. Okay, well, here's your license and stuff like that. You have a good day, sir. You too. Keep that, Mr. Officer, in the blue helmet. Wait, what? Treat yourself with nothing that. Okay. Yeah, that's gonna be all good. So... If you want to stay around here and make sure he doesn't leave with that stuff on, I'm gonna go. Special beats in five four, yeah, five it. miles. So we're now gonna sit across the road. And watch him and make sure he's not leaving with that legal tent. Or, excuse me, not legal tent, with the, uh, ah, uh, underglow. So we got the officer across the way and we got ourselves making sure he does not have the underglow on. So we're just going to wait for him to leave and make sure he does not have it. Oh, that unit just took off for me. Did he have it? Did he turn it off? Yeah, I believe so. Okay, awesome. I didn't see it on. I'm going to turn around here actually and get fuel. Uh, I got to run by the station real quick. Okay. So we're actually going to call ourselves off of this. So this is actually 10-8. Uh, excuse me, code 4 10 uh, dispatches. I think he said 10-5. So, I'm gonna fill up with fuel and uh, get back in the room. Well, that was an interesting little traffic stop there. One Bravo to dispatch, show me 11 of a um, uh, black white sports car on the Great Ocean Highway near Fossil Code 10 11. Requesting um, 1071. So he is requesting a 1071, and for those of you who don't know, that is requesting a supervisor. So I actually have to head over there, get that 1001. Uh, can you repeat your location, Bravo? 
On Great Ocean Highway near postal code 1011. Ah, uh, 10 core. I'll be heading over there, code 2. But we're this actually heading over there for that. Uh, one single one dispatch. Be aware that scene is code for uh, Bravo 45 is going to be on a 10 11 right now, which I am heading over to as a supervisor. Simple. <laughs> What's going on? Um, hey Mackin, um, following situation, I saw him uh, driving uh, over red light. Okay, well, I literally um, just pulled him over for doing the exact car. same thing. I literally just had him pulled over a second right. ago for a legal window tint uh, and a legal underglow and just reckless driving because he crossed double yellow in this. So he knows that he's already been, he was literally just warned like maybe. 10 minutes ago. Yeah. Okay. Uh, do we want to talk with him? Uh, I mean, it's your traffic stuff. You oh, can talk with him. I'll just be a, I'll just be a backup unit. You want? You can go ahead Good and talk to, to him. I said you can go ahead and talk to him. You're the initial unit, so I'll let you talk to him. All right. Yeah. All right, sir. Um, can you please give me your identification? Well, why did you pull me up? Uh, I will explain it to you in a few minutes. Well, Mr. Uh, nice cop over there, little piggy, he has my ID. Uh, no, sir. I gave it back to you with the tickets. This is some bullshit. I followed all the laws all the way back here. One take one dispatch. Now tell me why you take one. Up. Be aware, ten eleven is going to be with that same banshee again. Uh, reason for stop is going to be running a, another red light. Okay, sir. Right, so, um... Go ahead. Yeah. No, no, you. So the reason you're being stopped is because this officer uh, on your driver's side there witnessed you running another red light, and I had literally just stopped you. About, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you talking about the one like right there by the gas station? Uh, I made a right turn right there. I yielded. I made a right what, turn. What uh, light did lane. he? Was the red light on? Uh, the thing is, you are driving over red light, and it's, it is not important in which direction you are driving or, or which lane. The thing is, well, you are driving over red lights or and dangerous it's to all other uh, people in this uh, traffic. It, you can go through a red light when you're turning right. Here, Jeffrey, come back here for a moment. You have to yield or stop. So which red light did you he actually run through? Was it this intersection here, or was it the one over there by the gas station? By the gas station. So he was at that intersection back there, at that intersection, and he turned... Did he stop at the intersection and then turn right? I wouldn't call it an... Um, absolute stop, but yes, he was so he just So he kind of, he just rolled, he kind of rolled through it like a rolling stop kind of thing? He was going to stop, but he just kind of, yes. he slowed down and then went through, so he didn't actually stop. Yeah. This be okay. Well, I already know all his information, so, and I already know his things, so it's not going to be that big of a deal, because I doubt that he's racked anything up within the 10 minutes that you stop. Uh, so I'll go talk to him. Okay. Uh, sir, here's your driver's license and stuff back. You need to make sure that you don't do a rolling stop through intersections, okay? So you need to make sure you come According to a complete... According to the law, hold on, hold on. According to the law, you have to yield or stop if there's cars or if there's not cars. I yielded Take about two miles per hour no, and no. Then rolled right around the corner. Sir, if it's a red light, you, it's not a yield. It's a full stop if it's a red light. Well, heck you. All right, what more? 
I'm just gonna, I'm giving you a verbal warning that you need to make sure that you do a complete stop at red lights before you turn right, okay? Alright, is that okay. it? Okay, yep, that's it, you're free to go. Tango 57, Mega 01. Is this really so in America? What? Is this really so in America that when you are slowing down or... You're not, you, light, you're allowed to turn right on red. Uh, in America, you're allowed to turn right on red, but you have to come to a complete stop at the intersection. And, like, it, you have to treat it like a stop sign, so if you're turning right at, like, an intersection like that, he has to come to a complete stop and then turn right. Then he can turn right and make sure that all the traffic, there's not, he's not going to stop traffic. So, oh, okay. So, he does, yeah, he, in... he can, you can't turn right on red, but you have to come to a complete stop and make sure you're not going to cut off anybody. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Okay. That's interesting. In yeah, Germany, every I, cop would beat your ass for that. Yeah. Yeah, in America, it's a little bit different. Obviously, you got to get used to some of the different laws and stuff like that, but that's okay. I understand why he stopped, because technically, he, if he just... He slowed down, but went through it still, and he didn't fully stop and, like, check traffic, then, yeah, technically, he was breaking the law, so... Okay, yep, that's fine, though. You're totally okay, okay. with calling me and that's stuff like that. Thank yep. You. It's just a learning lesson. That's all it is. One second, one dispatch. Yeah, that's fine. Dispatch is 10 5 at the moment. Oh, okay, 10 4. Uh, me and Bravo 45 are going to both be 10 8 from that scene. Uh, verbal warning given. Hey, Chrome. I'd like to thank you guys for uh, watching this episode on uh, the San Andreas vs. Response server. Today we had a quite fun patrol. We uh, did some fun stuff down in Sandy, then we moved our way up to Polito. We had uh, some fun responses to go to obviously um and if you guys did enjoy this video uh make sure to like it if you guys do want to keep seeing more of these videos that come out just uh, subscribe and you guys can get notifications on those um if you guys are interested in joining the community all the stuff will be down in the description so you guys are totally welcome to come and join we're always looking for new members and yeah i'll see you guys uh in the next episode